The iteration of the Maruti Suzuki Fonks will be launching this festival season in India. It will be powered by both 1.2 litre and 1.0 litre petrol engines. Maruti Suzuki introduced the Invicto Premium MPV which is based on the Toyota Innova High Cross. The mutual synergy has been successful over the years as the rebadge models for the domestic and international markets and jointly made models such as the Maruti Suzuki Grand Vitara and Toyota Urban Cruiser High Rider has been well received. Next up, uh, Toyota is expected to rebadge the Maruti Suzuki Funks. The Japanese brand iteration of the Ertega also appears to be in the work. Maruti Suzuki unveiled the Funks alongside with the Jimny at the 2023 Auto Expo and both are sold to the Nexa Premium outlet. The Funks has been raking very good volumes every month and is positioned below the Brezza compact SUV in the company's lineup. The company's SUV Coupe is based on the Baleno Premium hatchback and has several commonalities including lightweight heat tech platform. It will be called a Taser, but it is kind of sad. Toyota being the world's largest or second largest automotive maker, they have only launched two international models in India. One is the Fortuner and one is the Innova. The both of them are now ridiculously priced to the time they were launched 10-15 years ago or nearly two decades ago. Toyota tried bringing their cars into India like Corolla but then saloons have died off in India. Then they bought the Yaris, they overpriced it, they tried the Camry. Maybe Camry is still there in some limit but it's sad because the quality of Maruti is actually lower than Toyota. Maybe in the future generation if they co-develop such platforms and launch and then it will be a better idea but then it's really sad that Toyota with all the engineering capabilities cannot launch a decent international model of theirs in India.